Hey guys, turns out we can fight the Alchemist right now. Is it B or Y? It's Y. It's Y? Okay. Okay. I'm Why would you ask that? Because I'm very bad at this game. Uh, yeah, I'm playing right now, so be ready for a lot of failures. You know, I, you know, you're gonna be fine. I don't know, man. I mean, you, you, you play video games all the time. I play video games all the time. I don't play this video game. You, all the you're time. gonna be fine. It's gonna be totally, all right. All right. These are B, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna do fine. I still have to ask about the controls like six hours into the game. <laughs> That's all right. By the way, if you guys hear any meows or whatever, we have a cat at our feet. Yeah, that's my cat, Gloria. Gloria. Named after the uh, hippo. From Madagascar? From Madagascar. It's because she's a fat cat. Yeah. I gotta say, Gloria is a good cat name. Mm-hmm. Oh, gosh. Uh, sorry if anyone's named Gloria in real life and I offended you. But Gloria's a good cat name. Gloria is just a good name. It is a good name. You know what's a name that, like... It seemed like it died off for a long time, and now it's kind of making a comeback. Barbara. Oh yeah, yeah. Because a lot of uh, they call a lot of people are just they call them Barbie. Yeah. So, but like, I, I I haven't ever met anyone named Barbara. Like, yeah, it's all like Barbie. Like that's their actual name. Yeah. Which I'm like, that's weird to be named after a doll. But, uh, but I think Barbara's gonna make a comeback, name wise. For sure. Yeah. Is there any names that you can think of that, like, either need to stop, like, people need to stop being named this name, or... Uh, yeah, Apple. Apple, that's a good one. <laughs> um, or, like, you, you, you like this name and you wish it made a comeback with people. Like, I think, personally, sorry to everyone, personally, I think the name Keith should just stop. <laughs> I don't like that name. I think, I uh... I really like the name Isabella. It's a cool name. And it's starting to come back in. Yeah? Yeah. Hey, I'm a legend. I really like, uh, like the name Griffin. <laughs> I like it a lot. It's unisex, but I would give it to a girl, personally. Would you? Yeah. I've met a couple of guys named Griffin, and to me, it just it, it's a girl name. It's like right here. It broke the combo, and then he can like counterattack me. And then, uh, yeah. let's go. Oh, he's got a lot of different attacks. You have to learn what they look like. That's the trick to this game. Yeah, it's all about tells. Okay, yeah. So this I can only attack with Elica, I think. Yeah. And then when he is blue, I can only attack with my sword, correct? Yes. Yep. I push A. Good job, good sword play. One thing I'm like only good at, I'm never good with magic. Alright. That is one ugly looking dude. I wonder, like. He's been playing with the magics a little too much. Well, I was gonna say, were these guys. Well, I don't know anything about these guys. Were these guys human before they yeah. served. Uh, what's his name? Uh, I, that's. Armazod or whatever? Yeah. They've been corrupted. So I wonder what they what they actually look like. I know. We'll never know. Well, that's what I mean. Like, I feel like that would be a cool lore thing that they, they could have put in. Like, he, here is what they looked like. So when you see them, it's like, oh, wow, they actually... They look really different. Like, if they had paintings of them or something? Yeah. It's not going to make it easy when we corner him. Got to climb, climb, climb. <sighs> I was really hoping that battle was going to be done there. Oh, right, it's why, not B. <laughs> okay, we talked about this uh, one of the other times. Why are these not color-coordinated? Yeah. B should be, or red should be B. Y should be, or yellow should be Y, green should be A. I'm sure there's a perfectly good reason. Probably which... because it's not like that on the PlayStation. Yeah. I would assume. It seems but... uh, Ubisoft uh, prefers PlayStation. It really does, which irks me, because I don't prefer PlayStation. Yeah, neither do I. I have nothing against them. I just prefer... Uh, Controller-wise, I prefer the Xbox consoles. Yeah. That's the, the biggest thing to me. I hear the PS4 controller is, is nice. I've never picked it up before. But I, I just like the 360 and Xbox One controller. It's crazy to me how many people...
actually switched over to PlayStation 4 because of... It, well, it really shows how important first impressions are. Because as soon as uh, Xbox was like, we're going to be online all the time, everyone switched over. And then even when they were like, well, no, we'll, they, we'll make it what you want, people still didn't come back. They were like, really? my decision's been made. So it's like, it's just interesting how people... Well, I, that, is that a glitch? I wasn't even hit by anything. Um, people will just like, based off of one impression at a game show, people like will not tolerate what they don't want, which makes yeah, sense. No, it's true, but it's like, it's just interesting to me that even when the company's like, okay, we get it, and they don't do it anymore, they're still like, no, it's you, you've gone too far, sort of deal. Yeah, I think they went tried to do online before people were ready for it. Yeah, really. I mean, that is the future. Yeah, but it the is. The problem is internet. Uh, is not good everywhere yet. You know what no, I mean? No, it's true. Like, a lot of places in the United States and in Canada uh, are just like, well, in the UK, pretty much everywhere. Like, there's places that have good internet and places that don't, just based off uh, connection and landscape. So a lot of the central United States is really crappy internet. I know Colorado doesn't have the best internet. Um, where we are, we got pretty good internet. It's, yeah. not, it's not great. We don't have, like, Google Fiber or anything. But, uh, I mean, like, we have... Uh, at my house, I have like ten up, ten down. That's not bad. No, that's good. I can I, I can play games on that, no problem. I actually heard one of the best places in the world uh, for internet is Israel, which is weird because you like they're not. Maybe it's because they're not that big of a country. Yeah, and I'm, I'm, Israel is relatively flat, right? Like it's not. There's mountains all around it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. So I'm I'm not sure if that has anything to do with it, but I mean, if Colorado doesn't have good internet, I would assume it's because it's so high up. Like, yeah, it's so mountainous that it might be harder for the signals to kind of bounce through everywhere. Also, we would totally be dead. We'd be dead right there. Yeah, totally. We fell in the most convenient way. See, you were worried. You didn't even... You didn't even falter. I almost died. But that's what this game... This game's all about almost just dying. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Pretty much every Prince of Persia game is, is about getting super close to death. And then somehow coming out of it. I guess it kind of is. I mean, Warrior Within... I, I like the idea for Warrior Within. I didn't like that the prince became American for no reason. Yeah. Like, that was weird. Yeah. Um, I liked the fighting a lot in it. My, my biggest complaint with uh, Sands of Time was that you had to finish them with your dagger. Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't like that. And that was my favorite upgrade in Warrior Within, is that you just straight up cut their heads off. Yeah. And you were... Although, it didn't really make sense that they were sand creatures and blood came out of them. That didn't make sense. It's like they went for a really gritty style, but it just didn't make sense for what Prince of Persia had built up uh, in Sands of Time. You know what I mean? Yeah, true. So this is all the escape now, because everything's falling apart. Yeah. I, I gotta say, for how, like flashy that looked i just pushed y like three times and that was it <laughs> yeah what was the chances of that how do we hit that platform how did we get out of there alive don't say it was our mom i was gonna say i got lucky you got lucky hey princess i'm the one that brings you luck i'm the lucky one you lost a donkey's worth of gold fell into a celestial war and you still want to call yourself lucky i'm still alive what about the alchemist Kill him? Can you see anyone surviving that? Well, if we kill well, you just did. Arm, then none of them are escaping. You killed him with your luck. I know, right? Good job. All right, so next stop here. I know this is a shorter video, guys, but we don't want to bore you because we're going to collect all these light seeds. Yay! Woo Fun. Running around in circles for three hours. Ooh. See you guys next time when we take on... What's her name? The Concubine! Yay! Booyah! Right. See you guys.